Hello Capricorn and welcome to your reading for November. So we're going to tap in, tune in and see what's coming in for you for this month ahead. So thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. So we've got four decks of cards for you. The Sacred Destiny Oracle, the Archangel Power Tarot, the Gifts of Life and the Oracle of the Angels. So let's see what you need to know. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know, please, for November for Capricorn? What do we need to know, please, for Capricorn in November? I'm taking out any cards I feel are jumping here. Couple on the top. What do we need to know, please, angels, for Capricorn? Wow, okay. A few of these coming out. I love this deck. It's really beautiful. And what gifts of life are coming to you this month? Here we go. So we've got the gift of growth, really powerful. And I feel you're going to be going through enlightenment this month, awakenings, realizations, having some light bulb moments where you're illuminated to the truth and you understand why everything's happened the way it has. So you're also evaluating things, going over things and facing the future, knowing that the past has led you where you're meant to be. And this is because you're growing. And every single moment of every day, we are growing. We are evolving. We are waking up to the truth. So move on to the next stage of your life. So it feels like you're going through an awakening and you're going through an ascension. And that's through enlightenment for you this month. So you're moving towards where you're meant to be. A new chapter is opening up. And you're also preparing for the new year. You're preparing to move forward into it with a better hope for the future because 2020 has been a crazy year. So this is also about understanding that better things are coming in and you're aware of this now. Recognize the resources, the skills and the natural abilities that help you to leap forward. Be confident you are ready. So the angels are saying to you, you are ready. You're ready for the next chapter of your life. You're ready for the next stage of your journey. You're ready and you're becoming enlightened right now to this opportunity of growth and the gift of fulfillment. So in November, you'll feel better, safer, happier, more at peace, more fulfilled with your life, where it's going and what you're doing. Fulfill your aspirations for your own growth and development. Now is the time to turn your thoughts into action with faith and confidence. And the guiding me to the number five there, which is about significant change. So there's changes coming in that's going to lead to fulfillment, to help you to see the truth. And that may take a risk. So you may have to take a risk to change something in your life that will lead to fulfillment. But this is the next stage of your life. So this could be that you're moving on from a relationship. It could be that you're ready to kind of close the door on that past situation. You know, the thing that isn't guiding you anymore. It isn't serving you anymore. Maybe a friendship or even a job. It feels you need to take a risk to move forward. But that risk will lead to fulfillment. And Archangel Michael, the angel of strength and protection and security, will be with you every step of the way. You will not falter. You will thrive and you will survive. Be daring. Allow yourself to experience new situations and develop new ideas with confidence and faith in your abilities. And they're also giving me there the number 23. So it feels like what you do now will have, have an impact on your life between now and 2023. So I feel a new beginning coming in, a new chapter, something that's going to lead to blessings and you have the strength you need to move forward. And that's Archangel Michael's sword of truth. So this is about you speaking your truth, daring to do what you want to do, listening to what people say, but trusting more in your intuition and your own guidance because you're being shown the way. And with the enlightenment card coming up, which I feel, okay, it's not there, but that's what I feel. They're showing me the word enlightenment. I feel this is Archangel Uriel opening you up. So you're being guided, you're being shown the truth and you're also forgiving the past. And November for all signs is a huge month of forgiveness, a huge month of growth, of letting go, of trusting that everything happens for a reason and that you are safe. And that's going to open a gateway. So forgive the past. Remember, everything that's happened has grown you. It's made you stronger and it's enlightened you to the truth. And because of that, there's a beautiful gateway opening to this magical future ahead. 
that's going to lead to fulfillment and abundance magic coming in blessings on the way and a new beginning how beautiful is this so a new beginning coming in for you capricorn you just need courage to take a risk so take a risk and move forward go for what you want don't be afraid especially if this is connected with the past so there's a lot of healing going on and a lot of forgiving so if someone asks for your forgiveness from the past you have a conscious choice to make do you forgive and move forward or do you forgive and shut the door I feel someone from the past is possibly returning to your life this month with an offer of forgiveness, saying sorry to you, asking for a fresh start. And this is something you have to do for you, some change you need to make for you. So there's new friendships or rekindled re relationships or connections. So it feels like someone from the past is coming back. Something is returning to your life to be healed so that you can grow and start the next chapter and wherever you go whatever you do you will be guided Archangel Michael will be with you helping you to move forward this is really powerful because if you've got a connection with um, an Aquarius they're giving me the word Aquarius they're also giving me Sagittarius this could be a big change because I feel it's the same energy for the month ahead so this could be an Aquarius or a Sagittarius coming back into your life but whatever sign they are, it's the opportunity to forgive. Listen to your inner calling and do what you're guided to do. Don't worry about the past, it's gone. You are being guided to forget that right now and to trust that everyone makes mistakes and everyone is doing the best they can with the information that they have and the experiences that you're having and making you stronger. So trust that you can create your world the way you want it to be. And this is the number 11 there. Obviously a big sign for November, but it's also a sign of creation and a sign of enlightenment and that the universe has got your back, that you are a creator, that you create your dreams. So if you're thinking about someone from the past right now, wanting them to come back into your life, then you are a creator. And you are manifesting your dreams. So it's showing you that the things you're thinking about are being created into your reality. And that's bringing in change. It's also giving you the power to move forward. To be confident. To trust in your success. To remember that when you fall down, you get back up. That nothing can hurt you in spiritual truth because you are protected. And that you are safe. And that everything that you go through heals you it grows you, it's an opportunity to learn, the angels are saying to you, you've done a wonderful job, it's time to move on, it's time to move on to the next project, the next chapter of your life, you're ready for a new beginning, you're ready for a fresh start, now this could be with someone from the past, or you may decide to close that chapter, and begin again but whatever you do, the angels are guiding you forward, and you're being illuminated to the truth, because the wheel has got you and the angels are saying to you since October you've been going through a lot of changes and new beginnings and fresh starts so the angels are leading you and directing you where you're meant to go because fate and destiny have got hold of this there's a new beginning and end of a delay and a change in direction that offers happiness so you've been moved forward now towards fulfillment towards the life of your dreams towards your dreams coming true and there will be a celebration. So this is you feeling blissful, happy, joyful, standing in your power and knowing your truth. Nurture yourself in those you love. The ability to make anything more beautiful, practical and wise advice. So you're gaining intuition from above. Your intuition is spot on. You know what to do. You're gaining inner wisdom and strength because you're growing on every level. You've been moved towards fulfillment, but you have to take a risk. So the angels say it may feel risky letting that person back into your life. It may feel risky embracing a new friendship or a new love. Or it may be risky walking away from the past to build a better future. But whatever you do, you are safe and the angels have got you. So take a risk this month because it will lead to fulfillment and better times ahead. Have a great month, sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.